let's get you up to speed now on the stories you need to know to start your morning. A Glendale police officer is recovering after someone hit the officer's car. We're told that officer was responding to a fight yesterday at a gas station near 75th and Glendale Avenues. Someone reportedly had a gun. The driver, believed to be involved in that fight, hit the officer's patrol car. Both the officer and the other driver are now in the hospital. We're working to get more information on how they're doing. Later this morning, the state plans to release its May unemployment report. Those numbers give us a clearer picture of how many Arizonans have lost their jobs during the pandemic. In April, Arizona's unemployment rate doubled to more than 12 percent. Meanwhile, we're also expecting to learn more about how the coronavirus is affecting our national unemployment numbers. This morning, the Labor Department is expected to announce another 1.3 million new jobless claims this morning. This would mean more than 45 million Americans have filed for unemployment benefits in the 13 weeks of the coronavirus pandemic. So let's see how Wall Street is starting off this morning. We're starting on a Dow day yesterday. The Dow and the S&P snapped their three day winning streak. Stocks directly linked to a successful reopening like airlines and cruise companies underperformed. Wall Street opens at 630 this morning. We're going to keep an eye on it and update you on any major market swings. And now you're up to speed. Don't forget, you can always find the latest news on our website, 12news.com or the free 12 News app.